see. Oh, there we go. All right. Like in that view. Let's see if I can. Okay, now we got something. All right, let's get started. <laughs> Hello, everyone. Thank you so much for joining me here. Um, so I'm doing a check-in for Capricorn. Don't mind my setup. I'm actually sitting in the back of my Jeep um, near the water. I hope you guys like that view. It's really nice out here. So I figured, let me check in on Capricorn. You guys have the most views. So I want to thank you guys so much for um, the likes and just the feedback as well um, that I've gotten through my email uh, thank you so much so let's get started let's see what's surrounding you um, for the month or actually so far let's just let's just ask spirit to meet you where you're at okay I ask spirit to meet you where you're at Capricorn please give Capricorn insight and guidance empower them liberate them guide them towards peace happiness and joy show them what they need to be aware of meet them where they're at okay so I'm to do four cards Okay. All right. So we have shine. We have detach. We have uh, seek the truth and refusing to see. Okay. So um, this is going to be a call for you, Capricorn, to really um, operate from your heart space. Um, you know, not just towards others, but uh, towards yourself. Um, show yourself a little bit more, or not a little bit, a lot more love. Give yourself credit, I'm hearing. Um, give yourself more credit. Um, I'm also seeing here that there's going to be a sense of victory. You may have went through a uh, difficult time, a time where you felt very... Um, cold and just um, I'm hearing unresponsive as well um, you went through a drought a difficult time and now you're moving into um, this new path this new experience um, for some of you who are struggling with this it's just a call for you to detach from what's been um, keeping you in a drought detach what's been um, no longer serving you um, move into something that is um, much more beneficial for your your heart okay I'm hearing I'm also hearing in regards to love as well um, because the heart space represents you know just of course love for others so um, if it's a toxic situation, toxic relationship, it may be a call for you to detach yourself from this situation, detach yourself from this person because um, it's blocking your heart space. For some of you, um, you are starting to love yourself, okay? You're shining your light, you're um, operating from your higher self, your, 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 your true authentic self, and it's because you've detached from something. It could be anything. It could be a job. It can be, um, you know, a pattern. Something that was no longer serving you. You've detached from that, okay? Um, you guys have saw the truth in a situation as well, okay? Um, you decided to take off your rose-colored glasses and see the truth about a situation. Uh, truth about yourself. Um, it really could be anything, but you have decided to see the truth about a situation. For some of you, that's not the case. It's a call for you to, um, you know, seek the truth, basically. Um, take action towards finding out what the truth is of a situation or in regards to yourself. This is having something to do with the mind, okay? For some of you, you could um, have negative thought patterns. Um, 
you can have thought patterns that are like self-sabotaging or just uh, thought patterns of just deception. Um, you may have a tendency to uh, deceive yourself or deceive others or others de um, are deceiving you, okay? For some of you, um, it could just be that you are refusing to see the situation for what it really is, okay? Um, others of you it could be that you see the situation for what it is but you're not saying anything you're just not giving it any attention okay because this heart uh, center is shining really bright okay and this is the Sun so it's like for some of you you could be getting ignored that could be a silent treatment you could be trying to uh, profess your love to this person but the person's not really seeing it they're not really making an effort they're not matching you okay this could be a person you're dealing with that's refusing to see your love and see your truth and so since they're not doing that it, it causes maybe causes you to continue to seek the truth and trying to find out well fuck where do we stand you know that's for some of you not all of you or it could be the other way around you could be making this person feel this way they could be wanting to sh you know sh show you their love and devotion and all of that and you're not seeing it you're not saying anything you're not being receptive okay um but um Yes, and for some of you, I see here, there's a jewel here, you're seeing your truth. You're liberating your mind, okay? You're refusing to see the perspective of someone else. You may be in a, uh, for some of you, it could be a rebellious stage, okay? You're following your own truth, and being in a rebellious stage doesn't mean that you're a bad person. It's just like you're deciding to follow your own truth, and you're deciding to go your own way. You know, you know, it's like nobody is influencing you, because this guy has like a helmet, like a um, metal helmet on, and it's like, it's protecting him from any influence. You know what I mean? Uh, but what he doesn't know is probably but being this way could make him a hothead too. So this could represent you or it could be uh, somebody else, okay? Because um, when that's if he leaves his head in that position long enough, the sun's going to heat it up. Because the sun is like right on it. So this person could be a hothead. It could be you. It could be a call for you to just stop being a hothead, you know? Or you could desire for this person to stop. Okay, so let's call your spirit Capricorn, okay? I don't see this as bad. That's just something you got to detach from and really seek the truth of a situation. Be real with yourself. So some of you guys are already doing this, right? Okay, you guys are already doing this. But this is not too bad, okay? It's a lot of mental, a lot of mental communi communication type of patterns that may need to be adjusted, okay? There needs a, a detachment. It could be a way of communicating, maybe how you and your partner communicate, you know, maybe it's no longer working. It's, it's deceiving the both of you, you know, for some people. Okay, let's see. Let's call Capricorn Spirit. Call Capricorn Spirit. So I'm using these cards. They don't have any words on it at all. I'm just going to use my intuition. Oh my God, look at that. I don't know if you guys can see this. This is beautiful. So um, it's a person playing a, it looks like a cello, okay? And there's an angel here. So this is telling me, when I see an instrument, it automatically tells me about harmony. So your spirit, your soul is desiring harmony. And it's desiring harmony within your... I see this as your throat chakra, your throat and heart chakra, because it's a blend of colors. I also see it for your sacral chakra. You probably, Capricorn, you, you may want to, um, you know, like I said before, liberate yourself. You may have a desire to liberate yourself or to have more self-confidence, um, to speak up more. You may desire these things. So um, it's just... I see that this is a desire, you know, but just know that you can make this happen. Um, you're very charismatic. You're very talented. For some of you, you could play instruments. Um, but I see that, um, you know, you can create this harmony because you have the help of your angels. And I see this angel as Archangel Raphael. Okay. I see this as Archangel Raphael. Okay. So this is beautiful. All right. So let's see. I'll pick a ruined card. I never really work with these cards. Let's see. Much is for Capricorn. Help empower Capricorn. Help him be empowered. Help him heal. Help bring them peace and joy and happiness and clarity. Oh my God. Burkana. This is beautiful. This is a celebration. So for some of you, um, I see some of you have children. 
so you know or could be having a child okay but this is a birth this is like a new beginning this is fertility as well so um as long as you create the harmony in your life you're going to attract the things that you want you're going to attract the things that are going to make you shine okay and that's going to make you stand out okay some of you are wanting to be in the spotlight some of you are wanting to um get some type of recognition and I see that it's definitely going to happen because this is like a rebirth this is not even a rebirth it's a birth it's something new okay it's a celebration it's something um, abundant okay and this is just beautiful okay so congratulations Capricorn just keep pushing through and detach from the shit that no longer serves you okay if even if it means you have to look in the mirror because we all have to do that sometimes all right or maybe just a desire for the other person to look in the mirror. If they're choosing not to look in the mirror, Capricorn, let me just say this. Don't force it. You can't force it. You can't, you know, force the situation. You can't force the person to um, do something they don't want to do. Because we all have free will. And either way, who wants to do that? You know what I mean? Nobody likes to micromanage. Some people who like to micromanage, there's something's wrong with them usually. But you know, people shouldn't have common sense, and we shouldn't we shouldn't have to force anybody to do anything. Okay, so just understand that. Okay, and if it's a situation that you can't bear any longer, stop refusing to see the situation for what it is. Okay, because your heart wants to shine so bright. You know. Like, God really wants to just bless you. This is amazing, Burkana. This is a, a birth right here. This is abundance. So, create that harmony, okay? Your angels have your back. So, thank you so much for tuning in, okay? I hope this reading um, resonates with each and every one of you. For some of you, you may find that it doesn't. Um, it is what it is. <laughs> um, I hope you have a wonderful rest of the month, and God bless.